for all its issues and faults. Earth is still, a beautiful place. Think about it, the colorful sunsets. The warm ocean breeze. Dogs. Beautiful destinations. And, the fact that, we, are currently not being vaporized. Yes, life on Earth, sure is lovely, especially, compared to what it could be like on any other neighboring planets. So, let's get started. Let's start with a softball, the sun. Our sun would obviously, fry you up immediately, or, if somehow, you reach any closer than 50 million miles, from the sun's outer surface, then you would end up dying in just a nanosecond, you would vaporize really, really fast. Not a good place to visit. Mercury, less than 2 minutes. The side that faces the sun, is extremely hot. Conversely, the opposite side is freezing. The temperature goes high up to 430 degrees Celsius and drop up to minus 170 degrees Celsius. If you could straddle the line between the two temperatures, and, rotate between them, then just maybe, you could survive as long as you could hold your breath. Venus, less than one second. At 482 degrees Celsius, you already know, this one, isn't going to be pretty. Being the hottest planet in our solar system, this one is really a bad place to visit, by the way, Venus has about the same gravity as Earth, so you'd be very familiar walking around until you vaporize. Earth, 80 years. Thanks, to the wonderful oxygen in our atmosphere, food and water, and, everything else, that makes our home planet, livable, you can get in a good 80 years, you may live even longer, if, you inhabit a, blue zone, one of the several places on Earth, where people tend to live much longer than the general population. Mars, less than 2 minutes. Mars is very cold. But the air is very thin, so the intensity of the cold, won't be as biting, as it might feel at that temperature on Earth. With some very, very warm clothing, you could probably walk around on Mars. Until you couldn't hold your breath any longer, ball is in your court, to fix that problem, says, Elon Musk. Jupiter, less than one second. Being a gaseous planet, Jupiter would make for a uniquely uncomfortable life. This enormous planet, you would descend forever into the gaseous atmosphere, until you're crushed by the pressure of the planet's layers. You will die in just less than a second. Saturn less than one second. Saturn is the sixth planet from the Sun, and the second largest in the solar system, after Jupiter. It is a gas giant, with an average radius about nine times that of Earth. As with Jupiter, you descend into this gas giant, in just less than a second. Uranus, less than one second. Uranus is the seventh planet from the Sun, and, it can't support life, because, its oxygen is very cold and the plants can't grow on it. The surface temperature is about, minus 224 degrees Celsius, you would survive for less than one second on Uranus, and ultimately be crushed by the pressure. Neptune, less than one second. Neptune is the farthest known planet from the Sun, in the solar system. It is the fourth largest planet by diameter. The third most massive planet. And, the densest giant planet with surface temperature of about, minus 214 degrees Celsius. You would survive for less than one second on Neptune, without wearing a spacesuit. And, finally, we have, Pluto. Less than 15 seconds. Pluto is a dwarf planet that lies in the Kuiper belt. At Pluto's current distance from the Sun, the temperature on its surface is about, minus 240 degrees Celsius. 
it will get even colder as it moves farther from the sun. The light from the sun is as bright on Pluto, as the light from the full moon is on Earth. You would survive on the Pluto's surface without wearing a spacesuit for about 15 seconds. So, tell us what planet do you like to go in the comments. And that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. See you next time.